This Black History Month, doctors are encouraging black families to review their own family health histories, especially when it comes to heart health. Doctors say your genes can determine a lot. Senior health correspondent Monica Robbins explains. It's important for families to share their history, but especially their health history. Dilated cardiomyopathy, or DCM, is a disease that affects the heart's ability to pump blood to the rest of the body. And usually there are no symptoms until it's advanced. It's not unusual for this type of heart failure to happen in families, but Ohio State researchers wanted to know how often it's passed down. With a new diagnosis of dilated cardiomyopathy in a patient, their family members are at risk. The study tested parents, siblings, and children of DCM patients. And based on the rate of disease in relatives who were tested, researchers estimate the overall prevalence is about 30%. But the rate of DCM was much higher among black families at 39% compared to 28% among white families. This data can help identify those who are more likely to have this disease before it becomes a major threat to their life. Identifying risk and then dialing in uh, either medicines or other preventive strategies to prevent advanced disease. The study also found the younger someone is diagnosed with DCM, the more likely it runs in their family. After age 54, the risk of family members was only 13 percent. However, if that proband was diagnosed 34 years of age or younger, the risk was double that. Now, where there are effective treatments to slow the advancement of dilated cardiomyopathy when it's diagnosed early, researchers are hoping to develop therapies in the future that actually correct the gene mutations that can cause the disease. Bottom line, people need to know, talk to your family whenever you can, especially when there's a heart issue. Oh, yeah. And when you feel something, don't wait. Yes, absolutely. Like, you might think, oh, let me wait a few days. No, call your doctor. Especially women, because, you know, it is Go Red Month. So, and don't forget to wear red tomorrow. tomorrow. It's National Wear Red Day. But especially women, we're too busy taking care of everybody else. So we true. never open our mouths when we think something might be wrong. Knock it off, ladies. It's time we take care of ourselves. Coming from her means business. <laughs> Monica, thanks. Okay, red tomorrow. Yes. We're on it. Thank you. All right.